Hey YouTube, today we're going to be talking about troubleshooting your internet connection with AT&T U-verse. Uh, if you were getting a small little exclamation down there where your bars show, uh, that means you don't have internet access. Uh, if you call customer service, most likely what they'll tell you to do is to reset your router. So if you go to the back of your UVerse router, you will see a little light red button just above the power cord. Uh, and you're going to want to hold that for 10 seconds. And then after you let that go, you will all the flashing lights will start, uh, start initiating again. And once you do that, any previous uh, settings or passwords, they'll all get reset back to the default password. So let's say you had changed your password through AT&T's uh, address, which is 192.168.1.1. One, one, You're gonna end up on this screen. Now on this screen, uh, you can click on wireless up here and right here, you can either enable or disable the Wi-Fi. But anyway, as you scroll down, there is a place right here for the password. You can also, uh, right here, as you can see, says use a custom Wi-Fi network password. So if you had set up your own password and let's say you are not getting connected to the internet anymore uh, after you reset your router, <clears throat> it will go back to the original password which is usually for me it's like 800, starts with 800, but it says right here where it's located so it'll go back to that and of course the computer has saved your previous old password that you created yourself so it's gonna keep giving you the exclamation now the best way to uh, to get internet access again after you reset your router is down at the bottom you're gonna right click you're actually gonna click find the one that's the AT&T internet right click click properties and this is the screen that should pop up but under security you click show characters it's going to show the password that you set yourself so what you're going to want to do is change it back to the default password press ok connect again and it should connect fine now after it connects back into the wi-fi uh, you're going to want to go into that address, 192.168.1.254. You'll be back on this screen. Just come back under uh, settings again. Click on LAN. And then click Wi-Fi. And then you can come back down and then you can set up another custom password again. Press OK. And then you'll be all set. Hopefully this resolves your problems. Good luck.